What's up you sex travelers? Abo from around the good world here and today I'm outside of Vienna and trying to hitchhike all the way to Graz. Hitchhiking around the Balkans for two months on a budget of 200 euros. I just asked the gas station and these guys are gonna take me for like a hundred kilometers so let's go. I thought that it would be very difficult hitchhike today but I was so extremely lucky like Oliver was the first guy I asked today. Thank you so much bro. Check out his tattoos. So the concept is that Oliver will take me around 100 kilometers outside of Vienna and drop me off at the gas station, which is gonna be like 50 or 60 kilometers to Graz. Oh, Tony! Thanks so much, bro. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I have arrived to this gas station. I'm 100 kilometers out of Vienna and I'm still missing of 100 more to arrive to Graz. So I guess my best chance is to start asking people and see what's gonna happen. After asking around 15 people, I have successfully failed. Like, I don't know, probably I'll get it right at some point, but I'm waiting for one hour. But that's the thing, nobody says it's gonna be easy and nobody is obliged to take me with him. That's the concept of hitchhiking. I might wait here for hours or I can just get the next ride in five minutes. So, no luck with hitchhiking yet, but this view is incredible. So I'll just stare the view for some more hours here. No, I'm joking. I'm I'm gonna just start hitchhiking again. So I got the rod with these cool guys from a truck. I'll go there. I'm on the truck, baby! Adrian is the coolest truck driver in the universe. Like, he's seriously so awesome. Thanks so much, bro. Welcome, bro. We're laughing for like 15 minutes now. <laughs> it's awesome being here. Still on the track, still with Adrian, and we're almost close to Graz. <laughs> Thanks so much, bro. You're welcome, man. Thanks for everything. So, what's the story? I'm in this gas station, it's raining, and I have to get to Graz. I'm just 15 kilometers from the city, and I have to get there until 5 o'clock to meet with my cow surfer, which his name is Stephen. Also, Adrian was such a cool guy. We just had amazing time and so much laughter. Thanks, Adrian, you're awesome. Still at the gas station, still raining, still I don't have a ride. Okay, after all, I got my ride and I'm going to Graz. These guys are the best guys that I've met in Graz. The best guys. I haven't met anyone else though. Cheers! <laughs> Ciao guys! I made my first friends in Graz and now I'm gonna find the house of Steven. I think that's the house, but let's see. I wanna introduce you to Steven. Hello! <laughs> so I'm gonna stay here with Steven for like two nights and now we're going to the supermarket to buy some food because food is very important if you want to continue living in this planet I guess Every first day when you travel is kinda hard so I feel pretty beat right now but at the same time I feel good with myself so I'm gonna call it a day and tomorrow Good morning from Graz! The weather is fantastic today and the plan is to go and enjoy this incredible city but first of all, check out the view that I have outside of my window. Grass is nice, easy going, and grass is cool. I like it a lot.
Also, another thing that I'm very happy about is that spring is finally here! I'm going to find Steven now. Sorry, I had to meet with Steven yesterday, but I fell asleep on the couch and we meet later in the night to have some beer, so I didn't record any of that. But anyway, today it's a nice hitchhiking day again and I'm going to Maribor. We're going to a rest stop on the highway and hopefully I'll try to get a ride there from... for... <laughs> it doesn't have to be completely right. I feel like if you make some mistakes, it's... it's human. I don't know. You're right, man. I'll just leave it like that. Yeah, like, <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> There's a rest up there that... Uh, do you see that fence? I think I have to climb it. Bye, man. Bye. Thanks, for, <laughs> thanks a lot. So this is it, it's happening. I'm going to Slovenia. Okay, I think I'm gonna close the video here. If you want to know if I'm going to make it to Slovenia or if I'm going to die trying to jump this fence, check out the next video. Also, remember to subscribe, like and comment as all these things actually make a lot of difference. And always remember that spending less is travel more. Thanks for watching, be well and see ya! Yeah.